I purchased my Dutch sectional manufactured home in 2000 from Tom Raper Homes. Since that time, I've had serious problems with the largest investment of my life. I have had problems with interior trim, roof leaks, plastic window screens falling apart, ductwork leaks, and mold. The home was installed with a heavy plastic vapor barrier covering the entire underneath side. It acted as a pull liner. Screws drilled into the plumbing and a water line pinched between the floor joists and the sill plate of the foundation provided an ample supply of water to make my home a mold factory. Despite numerous calls, emails, and visits, neither the dealer nor the manufacturer would do anything at all to help me. The company and the dealer sent me back and forth, each placing responsibility on the other. The purchase of this home was my first mistake. My second mistake was turning to my insurance company. The home insurance company paid part of the bills, about half, and dropped me. I called about a dozen companies and no one would insure me. Faced with foreclosure, if I did not maintain insurance, I was forced to sign with the Ohio Fair Plan. My insurance is now three times more expensive to the tune of $1,500 per year. I called HUD and spoke with a person in Washington that deals with manufactured home issues. It is important that you get this part if you're facing these same issues. HUD could have made them fix the problems to my satisfaction, but I made the repairs before I called HUD. As a result, there was nothing the Department of Housing and Urban Development could do for me. I've talked with an Ohio Attorney General's office, and they said that the state cannot do anything for me. It is not in their jurisdiction. There were questions as where to go for litigation. Should I go to the city where it was manufactured, the city where it was built? After a lot of work, I found that it was the city where the loss occurred is where I should file. I talked with seven attorneys. I presented my case complete with pictures, statement from the plumber, the contractor, and the independent certified home inspector. All of the attorneys said that the case would cost far more to litigate than I'd get back. Most of them wanted thousands to start. In this experience, I could have not have been more alone. A large part of this home had to be rebuilt with half the cost being at my expense. I now pay $1,500 a year for insurance and struggle to pay the $20,000 second mortgage. Some will think this video is revenge on my part. I feel strongly that it is my duty to warn others before their economic ruin. This is the right thing to do. When I went into this purchase, I thought the manufacturer, the dealer, the government, the courts, or someone would be there if something this bad happened. You would have to be in my shoes to feel this alone. Please, before you consider buying anything from Tom Raper, Dutch Housing, or their parent company, Champion, go to the web and read the other horror stories from people like myself. It is my opinion that if you buy a manufactured home, you're making the biggest mistake of your life.